what happened to that picture because I did give it to her. And neither mm -hmm. one of them, Hope could Hope didn't see her father because the picture that I had of him when I got married to Jacob, he made me throw out all the men's pictures that I had. <laughs> so he she I had a picture of him, she had a picture of him. She said, did see. Him, she never mm -hmm. Later okay. on I had tried to when they got older, I tried mm -hmm. to help them um find them because they were in the military. Um, mm -hmm. Hargrove, who uh, became a good friend of ours, worked in the CIA area, and he tried to. Mm -hmm. he said he couldn't find them. So I don't know if they're still alive or if they did. There was one girl mm -hmm. in Long Branch who knew um, Hope's father, but she says she don't know what happened to him because he stopped writing her. So okay, um, I still feel that they can be found. Um, mm -hmm. take some money to go into it. Maybe one day, like I said, when I, I know that I'm going to have time to go in and really do some research, I'll pay for ancestry mm -hmm. thing and try mm -hmm. to find them. But I can't remember mm -hmm. too much about them. I can't remember their birthdays. I just can't because all that was destroyed. Yeah. So with the relationship with Aunt Nadine's father, what's what's the lesson that you want to share from from that one, because that was different. Yeah, <laughs> don't believe them. <laughs> don't believe them. <laughs> <laughs> if anything, yeah. Okay. And the same way with Hope's father. Let's say so. Let's talk about that. He held so, her, and he fed her. He fed her, but he denied her. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so you had Aunt Nadine, your mother was upset <laughs> again, and so you yeah, said when you had her, though, that you had to apply for welfare. Yeah. Because, so what happened with your job? I stopped working. Okay, so you stopped working. Yeah. Why? But, Just well, Because my mother wasn't going to take care of her. Oh, okay, so once you had her, you wanted to stay home. Oh, yeah. okay, so you had, okay. So you applied for welfare. So you were on welfare. And so then when did you meet my mother's father? <laughs> Same place. Oh, wait a minute. How did I do that? You met him that. How? Oh, I know how I met him. I met him at a, at a party. Okay. It wasn't working. So I met him at a party. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Because I was going and... with this other guy. I was going with mm -hmm. this other guy. He was seeing uh, another. He would never be able to come and see me on Thursday. I used to wonder why. So anyway, this one guy that I knew, um, and uh, um, Miss Roxy, he was a homosexual. We were good friends because we were neighbors, and we used to just hang out. We used to steal my mother's car. <laughs> when I see her. and I used to go out to Fort Mama and whatnot like that and uh, I, I tell you it was a trip <laughs> <laughs> and, um, and we used to go we used to hang out you know it didn't matter to me what he was or what he was because he didn't in interview with me so we went out and we got this other guy uh, who was a soldier to come, to come and get us, because well, of course I couldn't see my mother's car anymore. So we went out to folks for the post, and, um, and I would always do this after my children went to sleep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, we went out, and here I'm, I'm, I find my friend with another girl. The fool out of here. Yeah. <laughs> and I got me said, "Well, let me get you out of here." We was in this bar in, uh, oh, God, where's that? Pine Book. I can't remember the name of it. And uh, I slapped the fool out of him. And they, the guy that we got, grabbed me and, and almost carried me out the door because he said, um, oh, we can't do this in this bar. And so we went out. So the... Um, but we fought, he, he left with her and we followed him 
on a post on the post. And so I was going to really come to me and, he, and the guy came out and he said, no, you can't do this or whatever. So Johnson was, and he felt sorry for me. And I ran into him and I met him at, um, at a, um, a party. And he told me that he, he had already liked me and, and all of this. Mm-hmm. So, and my mother comes. <laughs> so you, you, you know, all right, yeah. So my mother comes. Yeah. And you said he, he was there, but then he, he was there. Decided. He, yeah, and he did. He denied her. Mhm. Oh my God. So what? Like what? What happened? How long was he there for? How long of her life was he there for? <laughs> So, sorry, just a minute. It's hard to hear. So you said a couple months. And then he he got shipped out. And oh, he, he got shipped you know, out. No, yeah. okay. So you didn't again. You didn't push, you didn't know anything about child support. You said. Mm-hmm. Hold on, you're breaking up. You're breaking up. Okay, because of um. The welfare was giving me money for them. Mm-hmm. I had to contact them to get money from them to help me support. Okay. All right. Now, you said that you had to, when my mother was born, after she was born, you had to have gallbladder surgery, so you had to go on welfare. So was this a new welfare that you had to No, I know. That's not. What happened? I, no, I didn't. I was already on welfare. Mhm. Oh God, I can't remember. Mm-hmm. It, it was after Hope that I had to go. But how did I survive with the Nadine? Ain't that something I can't remember? That it mm-hmm. Okay. But once you had my mother, your your mother was like, you had to get out. <laughs> you had to go. No, she didn't. I say was. But after I got. Okay. Um, we had to do something because it was kind of difficult. Mm-hmm. Got you. So, so the welfare got you housing. Yeah, they made okay. sure they had housing and whatnot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, what's what's the lesson from the relationship with my mother's father? <laughs> the same one, dumb. <laughs> I, I'm, you know. I still feel that it was my need for a man. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Need to go that way, and thinking that this is what's going to do because there was no teaching or no nothing about whatever. Mm-hmm. So, what about protection? I just didn't use it. Uh, let me just say this. I, let me go back. With my husband, we was trying to have a child and I couldn't have one. So I assume I didn't have any. Mm, okay. Another thing that was in the play. I didn't think I was going to get pregnant. So I did, but so I, I can't even tell you. Stuck. <laughs> yeah. You know, who makes you do things like that? I don't know. A spirit. That's why I call it a spirit. Yeah, a spirit. Okay. All right. But spirits have spirits have something to connect to. They don't just come from from nowhere. So, you know, um, like if I look back in my life, I can look at things that I did that were stupid. You know, but I can see, like you said, why why I did that because of some some need that was that was unfulfilled yes um so all right so we got three kids <laughs> three kids on welfare and that's when you said that you um you know, uh you went to school uh you ended up going to school and then you got the uh the job at the oil company and then bell south and then uh, you. Laboratories. Sorry.